Good morning. So I just wanted to say hi and I wanted to talk about visualizations today because I've been using it for for a while now and I'm I'm just really happy about it so I wanted to share it with you and I also wanted to share my city with you because it's an absolutely beautiful place I live and this is an amazing view. I've just been walking up the hill and I was behind those towers there down in the city and I have I have a bit of way to go I'm going up there but uh, it's an amazing walk and an amazing view so I just wanted to share that with you <clears throat> visualize vis visualizations well <clears throat> I have uh, I've started this morning routine where I get up at very fairly early uh, most days four o'clock a.m. and uh, some days five um, but when I do that I have these morning routines and I'm gonna make a, a separate video about them because yeah it's it's evolved and it's become a really giving practice for me and I really want to share it because I feel that that may be one of the major steps for me in having success on this journey um, but the visualizations I'm uh, Okay, there's the other uh, ladies coming. This is new for me, so I'm just I'm just gonna try and just keep on. <clears throat> but uh, what I do is I I visualize that I go for a walk every day, and when I do it, I close my eyes and I just see myself walking, and uh, I I try and smile as much as possible in my mind's eye and enjoy it as much in, as possible in my mind's eye, and uh, just going through it in your head first makes it so much easier actually okay going through it afterwards uh in in the physical so uh and and using this for more than just going for a walk now it's a walk today because um yeah that's what i'm doing today <clears throat> but actually just um trying to see yourself go through the day and accomplish all the things that you want to accomplish it makes it much easier because uh, then you set yourself up for success rather than just going into the day with no intention set you it's easy to fall into doing things that you used to doing and falling into random activities I have this YouTube addiction go figure where I just put a playlist on on the Chromecast and when I'm getting to the last video or the second to last video I just put 10 more on and it just keeps on going and going and going and you know three four hours later I'm still sitting there and haven't done anything other than pausing to go find something to eat and that's a bad habit and uh, it's because I ha don't have a plan for the day or s any kind of idea of what I want to do so what I do now is I plan out my days and my preferably my weeks this is new to me so I'm not that good at thinking ahead but my days anyway today I had to uh, drop off uh, my boyfriend's car at the mechanics uh, so I figured you know visualize that you go for a walk I was gonna go see a friend but something came up and uh, I had it I had a feeling that it would happen so I had already visualized walking up the hill and actually getting this this good workout out of it so uh, doing that having a plan A and a plan B both of them being amazing because walking over to my friend had been also great but having an amazing plan A and an amazing plan B preferably an amazing plan C then you're pretty uh, pretty well covered on uh, on doing something great for yourself and not just letting life happen to you but actually being a contributing party in what you want to accomplish in life so that was it for now that was visualizations i will be doing something on my morning routine because it has been in freaking incredible and i want everyone to know about it because it's amazing uh, if you want to check it out for yourself there's a book called the miracle morning by Hal Elward and uh, I read it after I started doing it and it's it just it fits in and it explains why it's amazing 
uh, also uh, Mel Robbins also talks a lot about this and many others I mean Tony Robbins also always talks about getting up early but never mind that was it for now and I will see you later bye bye